Okay, right, so. I have already done these levels. And the recording just corrupted on me. So, it's just fantastic the way it's working at the minute. I don't know why it keeps doing this to me at the minute. This looks like the outside but of the this famous level Coliseum is horrible. Rome. Keep along the walls, Shaggy, and you should be fine. Okay. Groovy. Right. So I had so many issues with this level when it comes to just the, the platforming like that. Like, it doesn't feel like completely clear where you're meant to be going. Or not. Not as I say where you're meant to be going. It doesn't feel completely clear how far you're jumping. So I did have quite a few issues with this one. The depth perception is just odd. Oh, my days. Ignore that. So I think first run through, I ended up losing like four or five lives on just this bit alone. The most difficult bit was this. Let's go. Let's go, Shaggy. God. His lovely green t-shirt. Right. Now we're on this bit. Let's not even stop for them. I'm not trying to get in fights with all them fellas. Hopefully there is a checkpoint soon. Yeah, let's go. Might as well get this while we're here. I don't think we've lost any health, but... Oh, that's a bad boy jump. Okay, we're definitely going to be missing Scooby Snacks now, but... On it. There we go. Can I do a single jump? Nice. And then let's jump up. Awesome. So this level is actually way harder than the first ones I had to do. I didn't know, like... Difficulty-wise, how hard it would actually get. But I think it's just... Obviously, with playing new games and stuff, can I get enough time? Oh. Um, it's getting used to just how the mechanics work and, like, your spacing in the game. It feels really weird. It just feels off. Like, when you jump and go to, like, land on things and stuff, I don't know what it is. I don't know how I can still, like... Play Crash Bandicoot and kind of understand where I am spatially, like spatially. But in this game, it's just, it's not always 100% clear. And I like to use the shadows as like a basis of where the character is, but can I? There we go. I'm only going to take out the, oh, you've got to be having a laugh, boy. Is that enough? Right, another checkpoint. I'll take that because at the minute I'm. Jeez. Right, I'm double jumping that. Oh, that was so close. So you can you can kind of use the shadows when you do the double double jump, but like that, yeah. That was awfully close to my liking. Right. This is concentration now. This is the difference between PlayStation 1 and PlayStation 2. There's some awesome PlayStation 1 games, but... I don't ever remember in games missing this many, like, jumps and stuff. I think I'm getting a little bit more used to it, but I don't remember missing this many jumps. But... I'm not really sure. It's been a while since. When was the... Oh, I forgot about the horse. Okay. Go, 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 go. I can't remember the last PlayStation 1 game I actually played. Have I played any PlayStation 1 games on the channel? I don't think I have, you know. I've played N64 games. 
no PlayStation 1 ones, I don't think. Oh. I'm going to have to play some more PlayStation 1 stuff. Like, even Tomb Raider, you can tell. Like, obviously, that game is made for running and jumping. He is getting unbearably close. Okay. That was incredibly close. Right. I'm so glad there was no gaps to jump over as well. I say that and now I've got a gap. Okay, any more? Two out of three, I'll take. I'll take two out of three. Nice. Cool. So, just thinking, like, Tomb Raider, it lets you, like, you can see properly where you are. There's no, like, just spatial okay what 282 out of 329 right okay we're gonna jump into level two yeah there's no like issues that i've ever had with tomb raider where it's like i thought i would land somewhere but not actually land there and the same with crash bandicoot and spyro croc no, actually, Croc was a little bit wasn't it? now shaggy and i'm detecting a lot of danger hmm. ahead be careful like more danger does this game ever end? Okay. Um, this level, I, I used it as just like a run through. Not sure if that's what you're meant to do, but that's what it lent itself to. Um, yeah, so this level is nowhere near as hard as the last one. I think I only actually lost one life on this level. But, I mean, like, it's not even the enemies that I'm losing lives to. It's silly jumps. Right. Oh, you've got to be having a laugh, boy. Right, let's get that checkpoint. Nice. Get myself up to 15. Oh, the timing on that was just dreadful. Okay. Okay. See, I remember this bit. This reminded me of Gauntlet Legends. Now, I was saying about the N64 games earlier, how it all goes full circle. It just looks so spooky, doesn't it? With the skeletons and everything. Oh, you've got to be having a laugh, lad. No, no, no. So typical. No, no, no. I need to stop being so impatient. There we go. There we go. There we go. I can't believe that. Let's go. Uh, what? I'm sorry, but that was not. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I like all these diagonal ones. Come on. Oh, you are having a laugh, aren't you? All right, let's see if I can get some health. Yep, don't mind if I do. Oh, I'll take two bits of health. Come fight me, bro. Nice. Oh, oh, oh. No. Tried me luck. It didn't work, did it? So how am I on? Oh. 14. Do I get one every time I reach 100 or something? Oh, this is going to be fluky if I make this all in one. I think this is where I died in the last one. Nah, I thought I'd be able to do it all in one run. Oh. Any burgers for me? Pies? I don't want pies, really. More pies? I don't think I need pies. Oh, maybe I do. There we go, then. That's the end of that level. Cracking stuff. Right, so this next boss fight is totally just unknown territory. Like, I played through them first, too. I went to go into the boss battle and then looked over it and it had just stopped recording. Absolutely gutting. So I'm like a 
Scooby-Doo Cyber Chase professional now when it comes to Ancient Rome. Right, let's get into level three. Are we going to be fighting... E I think we'll either be fighting a mummy or... You should know oh, better than know. to mess with me. Now you're a lion. trapped. You'll never get out of here in one piece. Okay. Well, I'm convinced. Now, how about someone? It's time to be extra brave, Shaggy. Avoid the spears those skeleton gladiators throw at you and run yeah. away from the lion. Wait until he gets tired and then take your chance. Three hits from your pie and you should have him beat. Okay. Lions and skeletons and spears. Roll my. <laughs> Roll my. All right. Here, go on, throw your spears. Where are they going? Oh, they just follow me. Okay. Oh, what? Right. Jeez Louise. Bit much in it. Go on. Is he tired yet? How many jumps is he gonna do before he's tired? Oh, it tells you when to hit. Okay, so can I do a bit of this to avoid their spears? Oh, they throw them in specific locations. Come at me. Right, the lion. Yeah, that was my own silly fault. I shouldn't have done that. So it says chance in the corner. I'm super concentrating. I've got three chances of getting hit now. I can't muck this up. Uh, what? I ain't trying to be a Scooby-Doo noob. Oh, no, I ain't got many chances. I've got one more. Let's go. That was it. That's what I needed. No, 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 no. Doggone it. We should have won. What? Oh, well, here we go. I lit I was like, oh, I've got it beat. So I didn't even do anything and then realized at the last second they're throwing again. You've got to be kidding me. These skeletons stink, man. Right, Con and Lion. What a stinky, stinky boss fight. Right. I think we managed to get through this first bit without getting Muller, didn't we? One more, one more, and then chance. Nice, there we go. Right. So please tell me that these skeletons aren't super organised. Right. I think they just go where I'm running. Jeez Louise. So I can do a jump. Come on, Lion. There's one. 
he's way more active, isn't he, on this second one? That's two, three, four, maybe. Last one. I'll take that. Little pie to the head. I'm doing all right health-wise as well. There's some room for error. There is definitely some room for error. Yeah, okay. Not fair. Just where the lion got me last time. Yeah, and he got me again. There we go, there we go, there we go. Okay, so we've got three bits of life left. You don't get another one, do you? Jeez Louise. You need to have some in the tank, don't you? But the phantom virus got away. Oh, you've got to be having a laugh. We'll keep looking. Okay, then. Fair enough. I'd take that as a big W, but that was definitely harder than the first one. You needed to have some health in the bank for that last hit. There, there has to be a way to avoid it, but not both times I did it. Okay, then. I'm going to call it quits here, then. We're going to continue next time in... The Arctic Circle, eh? I tell you what, I like the sound of that. Thank you for watching today's episode, and I'll catch you in the next one. Goodbye.